Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, we are talking about Wells Fargo and Zelly. And more specifically, I'm going to quickly answer a question I keep getting a lot on my other video. And that is, how do you pay someone with Zelly on the Wells Fargo app? So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off guys, this is gonna be a really quick video. There's not too many steps involved. So be sure to stick around to the end of the video. But why would you wanna pay someone with Zelly using the Wells Fargo app? Well, that's pretty easy. Maybe you have various contractors throughout the country and one of them insists on you paying them through Zelly and you have your banking with Wells Fargo. Whatever the case is, is a pretty easy process. It's handled here in the Wells Fargo app. It's this red, yellow, and white one right here. Check my video description. I'll try to leave the written instructions there as well, but I'm going to open up my Wells Fargo app now. Okay guys, I went ahead and opened up my Wells Fargo app. This is the home screen. Now here on the home screen, if you want to pay someone using Zelle in the Wells Fargo app, you need to click on this button down here in the bottom center. It's called pay and transfer. It has a little dollar sign next to it. Once you do that, you're going to see these four options, but in order to send and pay someone with Zelle, you need to click on this purple button called Zelle. It says send money. Okay, once you do that, you're going to see another menu and in order to pay someone with Zelle in Wells Fargo, you need to click on the send button. It's purple. It has a dollar sign with an upward arrow. Okay, once you click there, you can go ahead and choose from your contacts who you would like to pay in Zelly. But if you don't have the contact there, you can click on this add button with a plus sign. Once you do that, you're going to need to enter in the email address or the mobile number that that person has registered with their Zelly. Now, if they haven't registered, don't worry about that because they still receive a notification asking them to set up their Zelle account to receive the money that you have paid them. Also, you need to enter in their first name and their last name is optional if you don't know it. And then you would click continue and that will add the person into your contacts. So let me go back. Once the person is in your contacts and you would still like to pay them with Zelly in Wells Fargo, go ahead and just choose their name. I'm going to choose this one. Okay, so here you can choose how much you're going to pay someone in Zelly. So for the purpose of this video, I'm just going to send a little bit. Next, you get to choose the Wells Fargo account that you would like to use to fund this payment through Zelly. So I'm only going to use my checking account. If you have other accounts, you can click on that line and then choose the different Wells Fargo accounts you want to use to fund it. Next, you can add a memo. It is optional, but I do recommend it, especially if you are paying somebody through Zelly, that way they know why you're sending the payment. Also, you can reference it in the future as to why you sent that payment through Zelly to that person. And once you set that up, go ahead and click on this black review button here at the bottom. Okay, so this is letting me know that this person has not set up a Zelly account yet. So they will receive an email letting them know that they have received a payment through Zelly from me. And it will prompt them to go ahead and set up a Zelly account so that way they can accept this money. Now, if they do not accept the payment from Zelly within 14 days, this money will go back into my Wells Fargo account. If all that looks good to you, go ahead and click on this black send button. All right, next I get this confirmation screen saying that I made a payment to someone through Zelly for this amount and it gives me a confirmation number. So now we just need to wait for that person to accept that payment through Zelly. Also, if they've already registered with Zelly, oftentimes this payment will go through immediately and that money becomes available immediately to them. It's nothing that they really have to accept generally. So there you have it, guys. If you're wondering how to pay someone through Zelly on the Wells Fargo app, that is the easiest way I know how to to do it. If you know an easier way, be sure to leave a comment below. Let the rest of us know how you did it. Hopefully you found that video useful. If so, click thumbs up or maybe consider subscribing to my channel and I hope to see you on the next video. Thanks again for watching.